Good morning. As you can see, today we're in the kitchen and this is actually gonna be a longer spanning video for me to film just because we are doing what I eat in a week and I'm gonna try to aim for like five days. I don't think I can do a week. I don't even know if like a week is too much food to document, but I have gotten a few requests to do this video and if you can tell from the microwave, which I actually don't think you can see right now, it is 11.21 and I woke up at 8 o'clock planning to film today and then I had a whole mini existential crisis this morning and now it's 11. So it is a little bit too early for lunch and a little bit too late for breakfast, but in the spirit of actually eating breakfast, I'm just going to have some Honey Nut Cheerios and milk and that's gonna be what we have for breakfast today. Also today is Friday. I actually have the day off because it's a global day off for work. And I'll be honest, I don't really like to cook during the work week just because I'm busy with work and I don't, I just don't have time, you know? So that's why I thought it'd be nice to start filming on a Friday that I have off. I know this is somewhat disappointing, like you didn't click into this video thinking I would just be eating cereal for the first thing, but grabbed a banana also for like extra potassium. And then this other thing is vitamin D. I try to take it every morning, but vitamin D, it's like in my cabinet and I always forget about it and my mom calls me to remind me sometimes, but I like to take it with my breakfast and I'm actually not sure if I'm supposed to take it like after my breakfast. I promise that lunch will be slightly better. This is such a nice shot. It is lunch time and I don't know what to make. However, I did get this box the other day from Omsom and they sent me some really nice sauces that I think I'm gonna use to cook and they sent me this too. So I'm gonna make this mala salad. I think this is pretty flexible in terms of what you put in it, but I wanna put some chicken, lettuce, cucumber, and maybe some broccoli. Here is our lunch. It's very much a salad. I haven't really been eating vegetables that much, so this is good for me. Oh, the sauce is so good. I think I'm gonna pour myself a glass of soy milk with this. If you notice the dots on my top, I got the sauce here and then I got some chicken juice right there. So I dotted it with dishwasher soap, which is apparently what you're supposed to do. But I'm probably just gonna like take this off and wash it. Before we continue, I wanna thank BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. BetterHelp is not a crisis line. It is not self-help. It is professional therapy done securely online. There's a broad range of expertise in BetterHelp's 20,000 plus therapist network, which may not be locally available in many areas. BetterHelp will assess your needs and match you with your own licensed professional therapist. You can start communicating within 48 hours and this service is available for clients worldwide. You can log into your account anytime and send a message to your therapist. You will get timely and thoughtful responses. And in addition to that, you can schedule weekly video or phone sessions. You'll never have to sit in an uncomfortable waiting room like traditional therapy. BetterHelp is committed to facilitating great therapeutic matches, so they make it super easy and free to change therapists if 
needed. It is more affordable than traditional offline therapy and financial aid is available for anyone that needs it because BetterHelp does want you to start living a happier life today. So if there's ever anything interfering with your happiness or preventing you from achieving your goals, I highly recommend therapy and I think BetterHelp is a great platform to start off. If you're interested, you can visit betterhelp.com slash sarahpan and that is better H-E-L-P to join the over 2 million people taking charge of their mental health with the help of an experienced professional. And yeah, thank you BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. It's around like 6 o'clock right now and I'm just gonna head to this place called Hob. The sun is going down. I have my pepper spray and I'm just walking to get picked up at this place that my boyfriend introduced to me. It's like the best place for beer at tacos. And he also introduced me to beer at tacos, which is amazing. I'm so, I can't believe I didn't know what beer at tacos was before, but I'm like absolutely obsessed with beer at tacos and I have been recently. has been secured. And here is a nice little overshot of dinner. That looks so freaking good. Oh my god, I love this so much. Personally, I don't like the soup as much as the tacos, but the tacos dipped in the soup is amazing. Oh, no, no, no. I'll give you a snack. Good morning. We are going to Chinatown today. So I'm going to meet up with a few friends and we're going to go to Jingfeng for dim sum. If anyone knows what Jingfeng is, they used to be a really popular dim sum place, but I think they went out of business during the pandemic. They opened up the restaurant again. So I'm so excited. I have not been to Jingfeng in like forever. Okay, I totally did not get the memo that it was kind of drizzly today. I think it's technically snowing today, but it was 60 degrees yesterday, so I have no idea what's going on with this weather. And yeah, I just hope it doesn't rain more because I'm like severely underdressed for this weather. But anyways, um, it's like a 30 minute commute to Jingfeng from here and I'm going to meet up with James and his roommate James um, in the subway station and we're going to make our way over. So, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for doing that. Yeah, I made it. One second. Transition. <laughs>
Wait, this isn't, I know, I have a people interested in it. What is it? Hey, another looking one. Green coffee and tea? Oh, I played so. Yeah. Oh, shoot, where's that? Oh my god, he got a black coffee and a black tea. Oh, that's... I'm not mad about it. Yeah, no, I'll take it. I'm gonna leave. <laughs> um. 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 It is currently 8 o'clock, no, 8.30. Oh. <laughs> it's currently 8.30 and James and I... Ooga, boo, boo. <laughs> I didn't know if we can that one. <laughs> it's been a pretty long day. We hung out with friends most of the day and it's a little bit late. And then we have a birthday party to get to in like half an hour. So we don't have time to cook. So I just ordered some poke. I don't know where it is, but we're just waiting. So yeah. <laughs> Oh, this is big. Good. This is, oh, this looks so good actually. I haven't had poke in so long. Is that good? Mm, yeah, it's really good. You know, for someone who is so nervous to be on my YouTube channel, you really have let loose. At this point, you have the camera on me a lot, and then I get bored of acting like you know, normal. What does you want? What does you James is on. Oh my wall. Mmm. Nice to receive you. <laughs> My video is just gonna be background noises of you guys. In my mode. That's I'm doing fully for your. Okay, okay let's. Oh. <laughs> okay, you don't do it. I do it. <laughs> oh, <this is> yummy. <laughs> Oh, how was the party yesterday? We had a lot of birthday parties this week. Mm. It's good. We got there so late though. We got there at 12. <laughs> Why? Very chill, very intimate. Yeah, we all made out. Whoa. Really intimate. Oh, get her? She getting caught in over there? Oh. <laughs> Honey? Honey? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I want to say a vinegar. I hope so. If you like, sorry. We only have a bottle. <laughs> We're on the ground, but it's uh, Honestly, I love it. This looks so freaking out. I did want something like light, but then I was like, hmm, spicy sauce. Oh. Good. I remember when you made this for me. Oh. Is it my dad's recipe? Oh. Is that your favorite like type of noodle dish? I really like it. Yeah. It feels very familiar. Mm. <laughs> hey, Lala. I have it down the wrong throat. The wrong throat. You hate that. Hey, Lala. <laughs> Oh. Thank you. Oh, this one? Yeah, but I I kind of just want the mango slush. I don't see it. There's the slush. Oh, should I get this one? Oh. Huh? 
还得帮我弄一杯酒。It is a Sunday evening and I was really craving spring rolls. Spring rolls are pretty easy to make actually, but there is a recipe that my boyfriend's parents showed to me and I love how they make it. Um, they basically get some marinated KBBQ beef or like chicken and then put it with like the regular spring roll veggies. So I think we're gonna make that tonight. I went to the Asian Mart specifically so that I could get all the right ingredients. I'm very hungry, so let's make this. This is the spread, and this is actually the spring roll wrap right here. I poured some chili garlic sauce, this, which I love. And now onto the fun part, which is rolling all these up. This is feeling very mukbangy, but I have it. I have an extra plate here, which I typically use to wet the spring roll. Basically, the wrap is stiff and hard, so Usually, I like to take some hot water or probably lukewarm water and then put it on a plate and then that's what we're gonna, this is really hot. I'm gonna add some top water. I also forgot we have the vermicelli noodles. So usually I'll leave the spring roll skin in the water for like 30 seconds, but once that is ready, I will just transfer it over and then start like adding things. First, I am the cucumber and then the carrots, some lettuce. I think I got the wrong type of noodle for this. The one I was intending to buy is thinner and I think more opaque than this one. But, but yeah, basically I just kind of put it on. I like a lot of chili sauce because I'm just really into spicy things. But yeah, the next step for this is just rolling it up. Oh no, I didn't do this right. A little bit poorly wrapped, but <laughs> we have this first spring roll. Um, I promise the next one, I will try to make it more aesthetically pleasing. Okay, let's wrap the second one. I'm trying to make it not as bad as the last one. Looks a little bit better. Probably will taste the same. Mmm. Really good meal.
It is 54 degrees outside today and I am so excited to not have to wear a freaking winter coat. I am going to meet up with James and his sister for Hot Pot. Um, she's visiting and it's her close to her birthday. So I'm gonna try to drop by a bakery before I head over and get her like a cake or something nice. Um, but yeah. We're walking in Chinatown right now. And first of all, there's a lot of people so I'm a little shy, but it's so weird to me that it's like 6.30 and there's still sunlight. Like, what? <laughs> You're welcome. Okay. I am mildly upset. I pulled into the bakery and asked when they closed and they said 7. So I came here and it's 6.43 right now and they are like not taking my request. So I I was like talking to them and they just like wouldn't sell me a cake for some reason. So I went to one store over um, this like Japanese cheesecake place and got like an ube cheesecake but it just doesn't look as legit oh, yeah. so i'm a little bit upset about that okay. anyways we're just gonna head to the hot pot place so also i don't think i mentioned where we are eating dinner okay that angle no uh we're going to 99 favorite taste and i love this place um on your birthdays you can get a free meal if you bring like three or four friends i think um, but yeah, it's like unlimited hot pot and it's like 20 something dollars Which is such a good deal and I'm really excited a bakery to get like a legit cake but you didn't have any? no i went there like 17 minutes in advance and i, was, I also called them in chinese too <laughs> oh hello <gasps> so cute mm. <laughs> look at these sound Stylish. effects mm. <laughs> oh my god around let me get you a robot girlfriend <laughs> <laughs> no, but since no one else is around for you you ever seen those like fish I'll have mochi if you guys want. Mochi ice cream? Mm hmm She's really happy. Oh, I look weird here. I look <laughs> like I'm like, creeping. <laughs> no, you don't. Apparently he's never had it until I introduced it to him. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's 9.15. Also, these are widely available in stores now. So this is our breakfast for today. It's another work day, so I wouldn't typically make this, um, but I put in the chia seed and milk last night, so we have chia seed pudding. And that's really good. I haven't made this since college, actually. And I saw someone on TikTok 
talking about it and then I decided to get some chia seeds from Trader Joe's and it's just been sitting in my pantry for the last like two months so I thought I would just put some fruits in it and then eat it it is like three o'clock right now i just finished a string of meetings for work so i'm just gonna make some avocado toast with eggs This is our lunch. Let's try it. Not bad. I feel like it's missing something. But it's still pretty good. It's 6.30 and Kyle and I are um, making dinner and I think I'm going to make japchae today. <laughs> Wait, don't show my bad knife technique. <laughs> I made fucking cheap noodles. That was good though. Thanks. Mmm. It's Kyle's creation. Mmm. It's so garlicky. some Arizona tea. It's a little dry. I'll admit that. Dry. I don't think it's bad though. Woman between 25 and 44 years old. We typically have at least got a job in the city and a kid you used to be so close. Can you finish that? You gonna mind your own business? Meow. <laughs> Don't include that in the video. Are you sure? Yeah. Give you character. A oh, weird ass character. I only want to be seen as who's the suave, handsome man on your <laughs> channel that I want to. Want to what? I either want to be or be with. Mm. Not a guy who meows. <laughs> I might put that segment in, but for that to make sense, I would have to put in your meowing segment. <laughs> 